a dream cuts you off at a certain place. It kind of self-regulates you. That's what a dream does. You can snap out of it. But you can't snap out of an obsession because you commit yourself to it. I'm uh, Giuseppe Rizzi. My life has been dedicated to high-performance cars and, uh, and racing. I came to America, to Texas, in 1979 to start and create a Ferrari dealer. I met Mr. Ferrari in, in his office in Modena. We just had a very brief talk about maybe to work for Ferrari one day as, as a coordinator. I thought, well, let's see what happens. <laughs> We went to Le Mans for the first time in 98. I created Risi Competizione uh, a year later, and we just celebrated our 20th birthday. The biggest satisfaction was our first win at Le Mans. Le Mans is probably the dream race to win everywhere. Le Mans is a true test of man, machine, and team. The team has, has to be cohesive and you have to have good people. And those people have to rely on each other to build a good car. I watch everything that goes on. That is that focus that you've got to have. The moment you, you lose that, then you know you may as well just be a spectator. You just go sit in the stands and just watch the race. And that's not what I do. I want to give the best of myself to the people that are around me. That's how I wake up in the morning. You have to have total confidence in whatever the product is. You have to have peace of mind. We started working with Pakelo when we raced the Maserati MC12. The person that does the gearboxes, we checked on it and we looked at, we just, it was just a marriage made in heaven for us. And we've never looked back. Pakelo has the same obsession for the product and the performance of the product as we do with our whole racing. The Pakelo product has been a major asset to our victories. My ultimate goal is to win Lamar again. I don't think you can ever get tired of winning Lamar. The victory, yeah. It's a temporary relief. You realize that, that all that you've done is create a monster for the next victory. <laughs>